Why are you so delusional? Can you answer that question for me? Why is your ego so big and you're so delusional? You truly believe, it's three something in the morning right now, I just left the gym. You truly believe that you can go to sleep at this time? That you could be drinking beer and liquor every single weekend, every week, shit, every two weeks, and that you're gonna be walking around with a six pack? You truly believe that you can hate your life during the week and forget on the weekend and waste your time and you're gonna be driving a, Merce a Benz or a foreign you truly believe that's how it works? Do you truly believe you're gonna be able to stuff your face when you feel down? Comfort food, stuff your face, not control yourself, can't put the fork down, and that you're gonna be in shape, that you're not gonna have health problems one day, then when you're, when you're jacked up with all these health problems, you wanna blame God and blame the universe? Listen to me, if you're watching me right now, you wanna change your life, you have to establish the correct habits. We need to stop being so delusional some of you have such an ego, and I don't call it out half the time, but I know a lot of people that have such an ego. What's wrong is you think you know it all, and I used to be like that. You think you know everything. You think you know it all. You keep running from what's trying to build you. You keep running from pain. You need to stop running. Like, how can you not control yourself when it comes to food? How? You looking for the shortcuts, for the quick way. To get rich quick, to get a six pack in 30 days, that shit ain't gonna happen. When are you gonna understand that the daily habits, the things you do every single day is gonna build you and build the band? It's so freaking simple, but it's hard. The simplest thing in life is to wake up every single day and be consistent at the easy things. The easiest lazy things. Then when they see other people winning, they either say they're lucky or they, they feel resentment towards them. When you can't walk around this earth being negative in a negative mindset and not expect bad things to happen to you. Why is it? Why is that? The most negative people I know don't get anywhere and have the worst things happen to them. Is that just a coincidence? The people that I know that eat the most have the most body fat. The people that I know that drink the most alcohol feel like they're, they're just, they look like shit and they feel like shit. Listen to me, I was drinking a lot. I haven't drank in over a year. I used to eat ice cream, bluebell ice cream. There's a point in my life I eat bluebell ice cream every single day. Every day, insulin resistance was, I was all jacked up. Now I'm walking around with a six pack, waking up. Look, it's three in the morning. I already left the gym. I feel, I can go run 10 miles right now. I'm in the best shape of my life the most energy, my mindset is the strongest it's ever been. From alcoholic, from depressed, from overweight, from looking like shit, from all that, I've been there. And I'm trying to tell you, you don't have to live like that. There's a better way. There's a better way, man. I just drove by the damn fast food. It's 24 hours, the, the drive-through. Packed, 20, 30 cars. Drunk as hell. I used to do that. Everybody just getting out from where they were at. And they're drunk. Everybody's getting that food, they're drunk. Jack in the Box, Waterbury, all that shit's packed right now. And they swear to God that they're they living the coolest life, that they're some badass MFs. They're nothing. You're nothing. Listen to me. You're nothing. Take your shirt off. Let me see your physique. We could cheat all this shit. Let me see it. Let me see that six pack. Oh, Ruben, you can't be so, so, you know, so rude, so mean. I'm not being rude, it's straight facts. We need to cut the bullshit out. Take that shirt off. Let me see that little gut you got. Let me see them little man titties you got. Show me that bank account. Let me see you take off of work for a month or two without having to fucking be broke. Things are sad, man. We're living in a false reality. And it's time we get back to where we need to get. If you can't, you gotta put the fork down. You gotta put the alcohol down. You gotta go to the gym. You gotta push in life. Stop riding the motherfucking clock at your job. Ain't doing shit. None of y'all ain't doing shit with your life. And I'm tired of just watching this shit and not saying this shit. I, that was me. That's been me for many years. 
Most of the things that you guys are chasing and achieve, trying to achieve, I did that shit in my 20s. Made that money in my 20s. Had everything that you have right now in my 20s. And I'm telling you, there's a better way, there's another way, and you're wasting your damn potential. Don't waste your life. We'll be back tomorrow with another video.